What is going on, guys? This is KNasty3090 here. Welcome back to an episode of the Baltimore Orioles franchise, episode 31. We're in year 10, and I think I want to ask you guys a question. Is this Should this be the last episode of this franchise? This is year 10. We're going for our fifth title. We are a dynasty. Oh, and here's the lineup. I would love to hear what you guys want to do in this. Um, should we continue rolling with this? Or should I start doing some challenge franchises? You guys always love those. I have a couple in mind, the Moneyball one, and I have a different one in mind that I'm thinking of. If you guys want me to do those, meet me in the comments down below if we should continue this franchise or start anew. We will still do the Marlins one, um, but let's go into this, this series. We're on the road in Texas, but I would love to hear your guys' opinions. So we got Allard going against Michael Fulmer, and let's see how we do. All right, you got two on, only one out, but we don't score, and we're already down two now. Kobe, are you going to get us one out? Okay, you guys one out. Oh my, jeez. All right, we got one run back. Not the best performance by Kobe. Oh my. What the actual F, dude? All right, well, you're out. Let's bring in Grayson and see if we can just claw back against Michael Fulton. Their middle of the order is unstoppable. And they're not even, I mean, Mazzaro's always good in franchises, but... Is freaking Luis Urias good? 91 overall. He hit 21 home runs in the regular season. He's going to hit 30 in this playoff series. Got on base again. Yeah, okay. That game's in a wash. Game two. All right, Urias, we gave up Eloy for you. I mean, you don't... All you have to do is do better than have an ERA of 40. Can you do it? Going against Andy Beckman. Good walks per nine at 86. And he had a good ERA of 3.08. Let's see if you can get an out. Oh, jeez. There we go. He got an out. Okay, he got the bases loaded, but got out of it. Jeez. All right, come on, Roger. Nope. Gonzalez? Nope. All right, leadoff single. A double play. Good start. Obama's three. Obama. He's three for three with two home runs. I think we've had three hits and three double plays this game. Are you freaking serious? Well, at least that one we didn't cry out a double play. All right, Banfield got us a run. Can't do anything else after that. Let's go to the pen. Top nine. We're down two. All right, Bergeron's a tying run versus Jackie Hernandez, our boy, who had a .71 ERA, a single. Banfield has a home run this game. I'm going to leave him in. He flies out. Freaking Obama. <laughs> All right. Game three, it's a must win. D.L. Hall versus Anderson Espinosa, who actually just had to have a second Tommy John surgery. Let's see how we do. All right, bottom three. A leadoff single. A double. There we go. It's one nothing. Come on, Cody. You're one for seven. Okay, a walk. Phillips, you don't have a hit yet. This would be a great time for a hit. Nope. We are winning, but... I don't think it's going to last. Just only one run. Tatis grinds into a double play. Some things never change. Come on, Gonzalez. You don't have a hit yet. Walk. DL Hall has been amazing, though. Thank God for him. All right, ninth inning. Let's bring in Aguilar. An error, but a run gets thrown out. Burger. Lines out. We're still alive. All right, we still have hope. Only two runs. We've scored four runs this series. That's a that's a problem. So game four, who to go with? Alec can go game five. Do we go with Gallo? With that five year right? Or Rob Richmond with a four? We'll go with Richmond. Grayson Rodriguez can come in too. And we're already down a run, already down two runs. Come on, Cody. There we go. Phillips still doesn't have a hit yet. Rossiter, we needed that. Come on, Banfield, keep the line moving up. We did get four runs. We're gonna have to keep scoring. I feel like this is gonna be a very high scoring game. So Mike Phillips is gonna need to start hitting. I gotta take. Jesus, can't even get into the third inning. All right, this game is tied at four. And uh, Roster, I just saw, got hurt because Ryan is now playing. So that kind of stinks. All right, couple walks. Soto, fielder's choice. Cody, 
Field is choice, and now Phillips flies out. All right, tied at four. Ryan walks. Got caught stealing second, though. All right, bottom six. Come on, Cody. Runner got thrown out third. Oh, but Cody hits a home run. And Phillips got a base hit. There we go. Keep that offense going. All right, top eight. Next base runner, Grayson gives up. He's out. There we go. He's not going to pitch the ninth. Because it's the ninth. Aguilar. We're going back to Texas. Let's freaking go. Oh, nope. So, uh, I think they have Fulmer. We're going to have uh, Allard. So, I mean, his ERA will probably go down because it's currently at 40. <laughs> Roger is back, so that injury was not severe. Come on, Cody. Hit another home run. A walk. Phillips. Grounds out. Damn it. What the hell? <laughs> Allard. <laughs> Stop sucking. All right, leadoff single. And then a double play. Oh my god, we're down for nothing. And our offense is just doing nothing right now. Uh, man, Mike Phillips, what a way to go. One hit in the series. And their middle see their middle of the order it just showed up. Ours didn't. So even if I keep this franchise, I don't know if I am, there's gonna be some massive changes. I'm sorry, you can't just suck constantly in the playoffs Three. Phillips you got one hit in this whole freaking series in five games you got one hit point oh five three one for 19 that's embarrassing like you're that's embarrassing Roger wasn't much better he hit that one home run Soto I mean he hit 333 with a home run Tatis sucked Gonzalez didn't even get a hit Barrance is one of our best hitters at 235. Bergeron was our best hitter. Banfield hit a home run. I mean, between Gonzalez, who literally couldn't get... He didn't even get on base, I don't think. And then pitching, Allard was a joke. Urias was okay. Hall was amazing. Gallo didn't pitch. Richmond was a joke. Grayson was great. And then the rest of these bullpen guys, like Sheridan struggled. Franklin struggled. Merrick pitched well in his one inning. Same with Aguilar. But, um... Yeah, I want to know, guys, is this a lot? I mean, do we just move on and start a new franchise? I'm not too thrilled with some of these players right now. I mean, maybe we'll keep Phillips just for the simple fact his contract's so team-friendly. Yeah, we have to. There's no reason to get rid of him, but that is, like, I can't rely on him. If you're going to go one for 19, I don't know. Maybe you guys, like, freaking, where is he? Because, I mean, Gonzalez, he's not making a lot. And this was, like, his, like, really first year. But sorry, dude, you got to get a hit in the playoffs. You gotta get one. I mean, I'm not asking you to do... I'm not asking you to go hit 500. I'm asking you to hit one. And the Indians defeat the Dodgers in the World Series. So I'd love to hear, guys, in the comments in Game 7, I might add. What should we do? Should we start a new franchise? Is this the last one? I'd love to meet you guys in the comments. And, uh, yeah. Talk to you later, boys. Take it easy. Peace.